Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to another video. Today, I'm installing some LEDs into my PC. But these aren't any normal LEDs. These are LEDs that go straight into a computer and you can control them through Aura Sync and many other programs. The company that I got them from is a company called Wow LED. They're really affordable. You can get two LED strips for £10 and three for £14 15 pounds and anyway, one thing that I want to mention is this box is really premium for the price you get. I was very surprised. And also I want to thank you Wow LED for sending these out. They haven't told me to say anything, but I appreciate you sending them out. Thank you very much. Anyway, once you unbox them, they come in this like roll thing here. That's what you get on all LED strips. I just got a bit keeping them together. This thing here. Anyway, we're going to quickly unroll it. There we go. Three different bits. Almost got it. One last, one last roll. Almost got it. There we go. Anyway, as you can hopefully see, there's one thing here that goes into all three of the LED strips. The other last one's got a longer cable one. It's down here. So you don't need to plug these all into separate like RGB headers on your motherboard. It all just goes into one. Anyway, we're gonna be installing it into that PC there, and. One thing that I actually saw is instead of putting all three of these LED strips in the PC, we're going to put one underneath so that will give it a nice underglow. So I'm hoping that will look sick and I'm hoping all of them inside the PC case will look great. Anyway, let's change the camera angle and let's go. Right guys, so we're over here now. As you can see, we've got three LED strips. As I mentioned earlier, one's a lot lower down than the other one. So if you need to put one up the top and one down the bottom, you can easily do that. One cool thing about this LED strip is it's got tape on the back so you can stick it onto your case. Or if you've got a metal case, look, it's magnetic. It was, it was really cool. So anyway, I'm going to try and figure out where I need to pull it because it all needs to go into my RGB header down here or one up there. Also, I do want to apologise about the cable management. I'll try and fix that another day. But at the moment, we're still doing some upgrades to the PC, so it's a bit messy at the moment. Right, so I'm just going to figure out where to put all these LED strips. Then I'll give you an update in a bit. Right guys, so I've all done it now. It probably took me about three to five minutes, really not that long. And so basically what I've done is I put one underneath that you can't see at all. One on the bottom. It's quite, the magnetic set thing's quite tight. It's quite difficult to pull out. So one down the bottom here and one up the top that, and I've thread the wire through the side of the case here. And I might be able to show you but it does seem to be holding quite strong. Right, so I managed to pull a bit of it down, but I'm definitely not worried about this falling down at all. The magnetic thing is really strong. Right, I think I'm just gonna plug it with a PC on. Well, it probably isn't smart, but let's go for it. There we go, I've plugged it in at the moment, they're all blue. It's quite difficult to see this light as I've got a really bright softbox on at the moment. So anyway, now the light is really bad, but you can see the LED strips. I'm gonna quickly go into Aura Sync and see if it works. Right, so I've got it all synced up with Aura Sync. It seems to work really well, and it literally took me like a minute to figure out how to sync it. And anyway, I'm gonna quickly turn the big light off so you can see it easier. Right, so I've just put it on color cycle, and it syncs up with the motherboard really nicely. I haven't set it up with the fans yet, and I also can't set up the graphics card, but at the moment, the motherboard over here, and the lights sync up really nicely. Also, I think the decision of putting an LED strip underneath as well looks really nice. And if you're going to get some LED strips, they could be in the description. But I'd also recommend putting one underneath your PC case as well. So there we go, guys. We're back here now. And as you can see, I've got my PCs that are red theme at the moment. But I'm not stuck to just red. I can change it to blue, green, literally whatever I want. So I've had these LED strips for a day now. And it's been really cool, especially with Aura Sync. But like, I can have them to react to music. Like this flow through gradients, there's loads of other modes. The link to these LED strips will be in the description down below. But just keep this in mind, some motherboards have 4 pin RGB headers and some other motherboards have 3 pin RGB headers and some of both. These LED strips are for 4 pin RGB headers. So if you have an older motherboard, it might not support these specific LED strips, but I'm sure you can look into it and find some other ones. So that is it for me guys, if you have enjoyed it, leave a like and possibly subscribe, it really means the world and I want to thank you for all the support on my channel recently. So see you guys, peace.